This is how I made the aluminium fuel tank for my Aerial HT using an aluminium buck. The materials clamp to the buck which helps support it when you're hitting it with a mallet. You have to be careful that you don't crease the aluminium when you're trying to form it. If necessary you cut off excess material to make sure this doesn't happen. Here are the form parts prior to trimming. This is the welded parts of the top and the formed tunnel. Here's the tank bottom and tunnel with the parts cut out and welded in to clear the rocker boxes. Here's the tank top and bottom all drilled ready to accept the fittings prior to welding. Here is the finished tank polished up ready to fit on the bike. Mounting of the fuel tank on the bike is very important you must ensure that it doesn't vibrate, otherwise you'll get a premature failure of the tank.